So that's interesting that you started with the music. Were they songs that you knew already? Yeah. Or? Like when I when I was doing the video, like I felt like the music was the most important part to me. So most of the songs um, I knew already, or I had in mind, like what kind of songs that I had, and like I I felt like in the video, like I I got a lot of different aspects of like Armenian music, or like Americanized in, uh, music that represents Armenian culture. I felt like I got like a very like wide variety like representing that culture. So the first song that I picked in the video was more of like a sol a solemn song. Um, it's called Deli Aman, which is an Armenian folk song um, played on the dudu, which is kind of like an Armenian clarinet. The second song I chose after Deli Aman was Ariel's by System of a Down. And I chose this song because um, System of a Down is actually an Armenian group. And um, they incorporate like in the background like of their music like a lot of like Armenian like relevant themes, um, topics, or like even sometimes like music in the background as well. Also, the the version of Eras you used was an extended version from their album. And uh, at the end of the song, they have an ex, uh, extended part towards it. It's called Death War Meow, which actually is a church song that we play um, at the Armenian Apostolic Church. But they um, they added it to be like more rockish version. Um, the last song that I used was uh, Sign Dur Ofeda, which is uh, an Armenian revolutionary song. Um, which says, uh, <laughs> where have you been, O Fadai? Which means, Fadai in Armenian is freedom fighter. So, it's a revolutionary song saying that, like, um, the Fadai, uh, the freedom fighter, where have you been, we've lost our country. It's, a, it's more of like an exile song, so. Tell me about the three different songs you used. They were, I used Home by Edward Sharp and the Magnetic Zeros. Paradise by Coldplay, and then another song called Home by Phil Phillips. Um, home by Phil Phillips was a song that, or the two different homes actually, we listened to at camp. Um, we didn't have any radio or cell phone service, so nobody could download whatever was cool on iTunes, and we couldn't listen to the radio when we were driving to our hikes. So someone had them on their iPod and played them all the time, and they sort of were like, Camp, there was like a camp song. It became like a, a nice memory. So those were some that I considered going in just because I remembered them. For me, like, because they were talking about home, like, camp sort of becomes a home away from home. And I had this, like, theme of, like, you make all these great friends. It's something you'll never forget. So, um, and sort of the the way the artists write that, that music does, like, give sort of this comfortable, relaxed, like, but fun vibe, sort of, I guess. Trouble in my 